Hello guys. Well this is I think day three. This is certainly a Friday. Um, beautiful, beautiful day in Seattle as you can see. It doesn't always rain. It's very beautiful, sunny. Um, it's took me a couple of days to acclimatize. I've been pretty tired. Went out last night and uh, had a fat tire beer at a microbrew. I've just come up to see the Fremont Troll today. Now most people most people at the hospital, any, at the hostel at any rate, have um, booked tours and things to go around the city. Not me, I just get myself a local street map and get on the local bus and get out to Fremont. So I'm just going to walk down to um, 34th Street and have a look at the troll. Um, as you can see, this is a beautiful day in Seattle. And um, yeah, let's go and see the Fremont Troll. Right, here we are at Troll Avenue and of course where else would a troll live but under a bridge and here he is he's, he's quite enormous it seems strange that um it seems strange that I, I first saw this guy 5,000 miles away in a book in the UK and I, it just captured my uh, my imagination I had to come out and see this guy and here he is he's he's a real beer mouth look at the size of this thing Well, as you can see, he's pretty big. Um, I'm excited, as you can see. Um, this is a happy face. There's another sculpture that you have to come and see when you come to Fremont. And it's called Waiting for the Interurban and it's just across the street here. So it looks like today somebody's um, dressed up the statues for somebody's birthday. Um, there's a kid in here as well. Look. So yeah, that's the other thing you've got to see when you come to uh, Fremont. There's a little dog at the back here that's got the face of some local uh, official who made some complaints about something. I decided, seeing as I'd come 5,000 miles to see him, I'd take the clothes off and we could get a really good look at them. <laughs> 